this is Hui Xu from In the Art of Music. In this video, I will discuss D sharp minor triad arpeggio. A triad arpeggio consists of a three note broken chord with the first, third, and the fifth notes in the scale. D sharp minor triad arpeggio notes are D sharp, F sharp, and A sharp. From D sharp to F sharp, it's a minor third interval. From F sharp to A sharp, it's a major third interval. This is the D sharp minor triad. Based on these three notes, we play them one after another, up and down. For playing arpeggio, I recommend to play in 16th note groups, as you can see on the screen. When you practice arpeggios with a metronome, there is a common problem. Many students play three notes per group with one metronome beat, like this. If your score is marked with four notes per group arpeggio pattern, the correct way is one metronome beat equals four notes, like this. For D sharp minor tried arpeggio fingering, we use right hand fingering 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, and so on. And the left hand fingering 5, 4, 2, 1, 4, 2, 1, and so on. Every time when we arrive on D sharp, we use our thumbs, except the lowest D sharp and highest D sharp. We use our fifth fingers to play the outer notes. You may see on the screen that I marked the outer notes D sharp with blue and all other D sharps with red. Double check your fingerings when you practice. And if you arrive on D sharp notes with fingerings other than finger one and five, you can tell you're using incorrect fingerings. I also suggest you practice hands separately with only one or two octaves to be able to secure accuracy of notes. After you're comfortable playing the D sharp minor arpeggio hands separately, you may practice hands together. Practice one or two octaves at a time. If everything is correct, and then add another octave. And then add another octave. After you're comfortable playing the four octave ascending passage, use the same method to practice descending passage. After practicing the parallel motion arpeggio, do counter motion as well. Practicing every arpeggio with counter motion will help you develop some basic hand independence and coordination. Now let me demonstrate the D sharp minor triad arpeggio in counter motion. I hope this video is helpful for you to practice the D sharp minor triad arpeggio. If you have any questions, you may leave comments for me. Please share with your friends if you like the video. I will see you next time.